At least 70% of New Zealanders use smartphones, but few people would realise that most of the networks they're accessing have been developed and built by China's Huawei technologies. Their role is pivotal. Um, they really are bringing the, uh, the latest and greatest equipment to New Zealand, and we're making great use of it. And now Huawei is thanking New Zealand for its support by investing 280 million US dollars in research and development over the next five years. People have been very open towards our company and uh, treated us really fairly and we wanted to, I guess, show our appreciation for that by giving back and looking for what we could do more. Huawei's investment will include building two university innovation hubs and a new cloud data centre, as well as making greater use of New Zealand-made technology. This is a, a great vote of confidence in the New Zealand market and uh, I think um, uh, they'll be very pleased to see it coming in. Over the past 12 years, Huawei has become a leading player in the development of New Zealand's telecommunications industry. By forming partnerships with all the major phone companies, it's helped to build mobile and broadband networks across the entire country. But it's not just about building more communication towers. Huawei also sells handsets and tablets and wants to tap into New Zealand's reputation as early adopters of new technology. We see you know, that, that ambition here in New Zealand and, and that willingness to embrace technology and try new things. Huawei has already provided funding for innovation hubs like this one in Auckland where entrepreneurs get access to their state-of-the-art technology and it wants to expand its Seeds for the Future program so more university undergraduates can study in China. It's great to see this level of investment coming in and I think the synergies between uh, the New Zealand way of doing things and the, the Chinese way of doing things are, are really strong and uh, we should see a lot more of it. Huawei also welcomes moves to upgrade the free trade agreement between China and New Zealand. The more that's happening at a country to country level, at a business to business level, that's, that's really good for New Zealand and I can only see upside really for the country. And with Huawei already trialling new 5G technology, New Zealand is likely to be more connected than ever before. Owen Poland in Auckland for CGTN.